While the Indonesian Transport Ministry has briefed the media on the latest search efforts, Air Asia Group CEO Tony Fernandez was at the briefing and said the company is ready to offer compensation to the families of the passengers in accordance with Indonesian regulations. Uh, insurance is being dealt with and uh, all uh, passengers will be notified of the insurance procedures and we follow Indonesian regulations uh, for the insurance. Fernandez has said operations of Air Asia are running well, with flights from Surabaya to Singapore operating as usual. And he noted this is the first disappearance of a flight for Air Asia, which previously had no fatal accidents involving its aircraft. Indonesian Transport Minister Ignatius Donan said the country will check the safety standard of all Air Asia planes operating in Indonesia and strengthen aviation safety in the future.